A bill seeking to alter the Constitution of the Federal Republic of Nigeria 1999 as amended to provide for independent candidates in the country was remitted and referred to the Constitution Review Committee of the House of Representatives for the Legislative Action. Spokesman of the House of Representatives and sponsor of the independent candidacy bill, Honorable Akin Rotimi Jr., assured that if enacted, the democratic space would be widened to enhance inclusive participation in Nigerian politics. He stated this during a press briefing after the bill scaled second reading in the House. As the bill proceeds to the next stage of legislative scrutiny, Honorable Rotimi remains optimistic that its eventual passage will mark a major milestone in Nigeria's democratic journey. This is our seventh, we've had our seventh um, electoral cycle since the Fourth Republic, uh, the commencement of the Fourth Republic in 1999. And as we approach the eighth cycle, it's important for us to start to look at in what ways we can improve the electoral process, in what ways we can look at our democracy and seek ways to deepen inclusion uh, for people as much. Um, we've also created a website, www.independentcandidacybill.ng. That's www.independentcandidacybill.ng, where you can find a lot of information especially information on what the bill is not, because there's a lot of misconceptions around it. Founder and Chief Executive Officer of Electha, Ibijoke Faborode, while briefing reporters on the bill, described the recommittal of the Independent Candidacy Bill as a critical and progressive milestone. She expressed enthusiasm at seeing the National Assembly unite in support of the bill, underscoring their dedication to a legislative agenda that promotes inclusivity. Babo Redi also noted that the bill's progress in the 10th Assembly marks a defining moment for Nigeria with the potential to significantly shape the future of its democracy. A pivotal piece of legislation that will further um, enhance you know, and advance our democracy. So we're counting you know, on the media, as we said, as a soul of society to help us you know, publicize this, ensure that you know, the citizens understand the bill and the citizens also see it as the citizens' bill at this very crucial stage, you know, in Nigeria's democracy. Jiria Fem elects has continued partnership with Honorable Akiro Timmy's office to champion public advocacy and engagement towards the final passage of the bill. Annie T. Patrick, Co. TV News, Abuja.